Here's how to get the embed functionality back into your Jing buttons. The first ray of the sun is for capturing, the second ray of the sun is for history, and the third ray of the sun is for more stuff like preferences, which is where we want to go. So let's go to preferences. And in here we can customize the Jing button. We want a new button, and let's call this button the embed button. And we need to make sure to change the clipboard contents from URL to embed code. Unfortunately, it's going to look just the same as the other button, but we're going to have to live with that. So we'll hit save. Now I'm going to actually go and edit this other button, which is what the URL capture is, and call this button URL, and that way I can easily tell the difference. So I'm going to save that, and close this, and use the check mark to get out of the preferences window. Okay, so now I should be able to capture using either the URL or the embed code. So I'm going to go ahead and capture a little image, and I think I'm just going to capture a little bit of this menu up here. And so I capture the image, and then you see here I have a choice now for URL or for embed. Again, these buttons look exactly the same, but at least they say something different if you go in and change them.